Match day 23 of the Euro Indian Super League takes us back to the capital where the Dynamos of Delhi are up against the Highlanders of Northeast United FC. It's the fourth home game of the season with the home side enduring a difficult start to their campaign. Having picked up maximum points on the road, Northeast would look, be looking to continue that winning momentum away from home as we kick off at the Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium with a whistle of Senthil Nathan, the referee today. Delhi in white, Northeast United FC in their away kit of black. As we get uh, Preetam Kotal, the captain of Delhi, to get a first touch off the ball. It's very important for Delhi to begin well given the way their season has gone so far. Northeast United FC know that Delhi are under pressure. Robert, the left back. We get a glimpse of Juan Masia, who's come on in this game. Juan Masia still going. Doran Soro is there for Delhi. Well, he probably tried to do a bit too much and ended up doing very little, but he had options on the right. Well, he's made a nice little run down this left-hand side. And my worry is with... Uh... For 2016, Russell, when they picked up three wins in their first four games and nine points as a result. Here's a chance for Delhi! Wow, Pavan Kumar took an almighty risk trying to clear that. Didn't do so well. Important in this, these early stages. Northeast on the attack again. Opeche hits the crossbar. Gallego still floating around in there. Masia, no handball given yet. Masia turns and shoots. Well, it could have been one, two, or maybe three nil, and just one attempt by Northeast, but it is still nil nil in Delhi. Well, it could have been one each. It's quite a bit, quite interesting. See how quickly Opeche got his shot away on the edge of the 18 yard box. Gallego to take it. Got plenty of power to it, but nothing really else apart from that. We'll find you in and around the width of that 18-yard box. Which is what Narayan is trying to do. Swivelun heads it, but keeper is alert to the occasion. Was off balance when he was trying to head the ball, Swivelun. Thankfully for him, the flood has stopped. Decent cross. Put right on the penalty spot. Inviting people to go and attack the ball. Maybe they got in there a little bit too early. Once he's gone out, you've got to re readjust your position. The Delhi back four picking the ball up. There he is again. Got massive, great big hole to turn into. Oh, the keeper had to come off his line in a hurry. I bet he was there onside as well. Somebody's got a marmus here when he comes off. He did it twice. He did it five seconds prior to that. And that could have cost them again. Good defending from Reagan, though. Breathen with the header. He will be disappointed he's missed that. Off balance. Just in time it properly. And it maybe here's an opening. Doran Soro waiting in goal. Header, a free header as well. What a save that is from Doran Soro. So just keep the ball. Let's have a look at this. Good header, first of all, by Sia. Pops up just going wide, probably. And then you think all good. Gitchi's got to do is put it in the back of the net, probably too high. Helping out in defense. It wasn't very wise, but thankfully for Delhi, it doesn't matter just yet. Nathan Center, the referee today, blows the whistle. Plenty of chances, particularly for Northeast United FC, but the scoreline still nil-nil as we kick off second half with the whistle of Sentil Nathan, the referee, who came under the scanner a little bit in the first half with a penalty not given in favor of Northeast United FC. With uh, Big Bartholomew of Beche fouled by Marty Crespi, or certainly looked like it. So I welcome Russell Osman back on that very note into commentary. 45-yard crossfield run just to close down. Somebody with a centre forward could close down. Here's a centre forward who could do a lot of damage to Delhi. Marty Crespi blocks it away, gets another corner for Northeast United FC, their first of the half and fourth of the game. Always changes his boots at half time. Ogbeche going for the uh, present yellow. 
seemed to be moving pretty quick there. You can see he's trying to find Keegan whips it, finds Massey as well. Gallego making that run. Wow, Marty Crespi almost struck that into goal himself. Doran sort of saves it, but it's offside, I think. Good decision by the referee's assistant again. The acrobatic save. Can I come off the defender last? <laughs> it was offside anyway. It's incredible statistics for Koro. The red card he'd love to forget. Again, getting close northeast. Gallego with the shot. Good save from Doran Soro. Coming close once again, northeast. Not finding the finish, the problem. Yeah, trying to play a little one-two, good effort. Just got checked out of it by Zubalu. Good defending from the experienced Dutchman. And as the ball was pinballing around. Now it's Zubalu, goes it in. Kaluderovic found himself at the far post, but only managed to find the top of the net, not the back of it. Sums up Delhi's half so far. Yeah. Hung up outside the far post. I think it needed to be a little bit shorter. I like those. Long ball played by Crespi. Tebar with a beautiful ball to Karu Jeremic. Desperate defending from Gergic. And eventually collected by the goalkeeper. I think that is where you can use Karu Jeremic to his maximum effect. When you're knocking balls into him that he can either knock down to people that are close to him, he can then play little one-two. Keegan with a long ball, shot for Northeast. Ogbeche was there, gets a final touch from, from a Delhi defender, so he's appealing for sure. Can't believe the assistant referee is not giving it in their favor, or has he now eventually? Hmm, not sure we need a different view on that. Fired into the uh... gives it out wide. Was looking for a throw in. Freedom does well. Oh, has he? He's given it to Gallego straight away. Good turn from Gallego. Great shot as well. And that is exactly what Northeast United FC were waiting for for almost 81 minutes of the game. The man who scored the first goal for Northeast United FC in this campaign of the Hero Indian Super League. Stands as the difference between the two sides now in the capital. Northeast looking for that third away win of the season, and Delhi maybe ruining missed opportunities already. One nil, Gallego's goal, the difference. Brilliant finish, brilliant goal from a brilliant player. Assistant referee's flag. He's onside. The run from Redeem as well. Takes the shot himself. Wow, goes past the face of goal, and so nearly two nil. Oh, pull it over left. What well, that was from Okra came out of nowhere. Yeah, listen, he's nearly smashed it into the far corner, but wow, well, can't see how that's missed. Some inspiration. Just waited too long. This could be a costly, costly mistake from the captain. Ogbeche! That's number six. That takes him level with Goro in this campaign of the Hero Indian Super League and makes him. The highest goal scorer for Northeast United FC in any season. Easy as you like from him. Put on a plate as well. And that's why he celebrates with the man who provided it. A perfect result turning out this for the Highlanders. Mistake from the captain, Pritam Kotal. And Gallego gives it. Perfectly in the path of Okpeche, as always here at the Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium. And that will be that. The referee sent till Nathan blows his whistle. It took 82 minutes for El Koshitori's men 